Hello friends, let's understand, understand about key awareness. We need to tell uh, of our uh, information design uh, tool course. So in this uh, video, we will learn about what is key. I mean, how we can utilize the key awareness to improve the performance of the universes and um, ultimately uh, to the reports. So key awareness means is an ability to take advantage of the indexes on the key columns to speed up the data at table. It is, it is just all about indexes uh, on the key. So all the databases have primary key and foreign key. Uh, so we need to understand uh, these concepts and based on these concepts, we can apply uh, the same uh, indexes here in the information design tool so that it will speed up the data retrieval when we are using any query um, from the report side. So the first thing is we, we need to understand for primary key and index awareness and then foreign key index awareness. So primary key index awareness will have the we need to apply the primary key index awareness on an object and IDT can substitute, substitute the object's column value with the associated index value. So instead of um, applying directly a column value, we will reference it to, uh, to the index value. So that will uh, speed up the data retrieval. Foreign key index awareness as well means we can use a foreign key index awareness on an object which will can restrict the values returned without the need to join the tables. So query performance is one major factor uh, when we design complex universes. So we need to set this index awareness when um, we, we are developing the universe. So this IDT tool can take the advantage of the indexes on key columns to speed up the data entry table and that IDT can generate SQL that filters in the most efficient way. So suppose an example is if you build a query that involves filtering on a value in a dimension table, IDT can apply the filter di directly to the fact table by using the dimension table foreign key. So this element is unnecessary and costly joins to dimension tables. Let's understand this example. Like suppose this is, this is the query which is being used. So when we have this uh, client uh, index awareness applied, if you see this is an example, inner join is applied to this client region um, and region ID and uh, country region. So actually region is uh, region ID is a foreign key to this client table. So we can un unnecessary uh, this join is getting included so that can be avoided. So this way means it can be useful and this query can be like this only. So client where client dot country ID in this 44 comma one. So this is again for a country ID. So that way means we have removed this unnecessary joins whatever related to country region table. Okay. So this way it will it will um, index awareness is useful by using a primary key and foreign key in index awareness. How we can set up a key? Uh, in information design tool in a data foundation uh, in the data, uh, business layer you will see a uh, objects is there dimension objects and then there is a uh, keys option there so we can set it as a primary key or a foreign key for this particular type and then uh, we can uh, like by by creating or this add key will will set it as primary key or maybe prime uh, foreign key as well means we'll have this option there to just to set as for foreign key as well if required. Okay, so this is all about index awareness. Uh, let's understand means what is the features, which features takes the advantage of the index on key columns uh, to filter the data retrieval. So index awareness is one of the features which is, uh, uh, which, which takes an end, um, benefit or advantage of the indexes on key columns to filter the data retrieval. So basically index awareness is when we need to speed up the data retrieval and if there is a complex universe and we have this performance issue, then we should look into this key awareness. So that is one major things we need to look. Okay. So I hope uh, you have understood uh, about this uh, index awareness. I'll be covering a practical examples in next minute video. Um, if you like my video, then please like it. Please subscribe to my channel as well. Thank you for watching.